Hi everyone and welcome back to Bet This For You TV. We have had a very successful week last week with a lot of winning bets and also this week we uh, are looking forward to a, a lot more uh, uh, football actions with the Premier League that will be back but also uh, uh, other interesting events like the final of the Italian Cup and so on. In the last weekend, Lucas Emproni managed to uh, tip correctly on Saturday uh, Roma to win the derby, what was three times the money, and also a double. And uh, uh, on the Sunday, we managed to win uh, our league on bet for the third time in a row as we tip correctly Lyon to win with one goal handicap. We're looking forward to this week. There is a lot of plenty of opportunities. There's a lot of opportunities to bet, and uh, we will first start with a double here from uh, uh, Bet is for You TV headquarters. Uh, specialist and then we are going to our uh, Premier League expert Robbie Billund that will give us some more tips on uh, a very busy week for the Premier League. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, all you need to do is to log in into your YouTube account and click on the subscribe button and also hit the bell as that will allow you to get notifications every time we post a new video. In addition to that, if you like some of the bets on this show, simply go on the description below as we place the links that will load the bets directly in the bookmaker account. This will allow you to save time, but also it will make sure you back our tips correctly. And normally you also get the best odds as we select the bookmakers that have the best odds at the time of recording. Obviously, odds are subject to change, so double check them before betting. Let's start now with the bet of the day and uh, well, with the double from our expert here, Bet is for you TV headquarters. It's one match from the uh, Premier League and one is from the Italian Serie A. So the first match that we selected is Manchester United to win and over 2.5 goals against Fulham. The fans will return to Old Trafford for the first time in over a year on Tuesday. So we do expect Manchester United to want to place a, a, a very good um, to want to do a very good uh, uh, performance in front of them and also in doing that uh, securing the um, silver medal in the Premier League. Fulham have nothing to, to play for anymore in this uh, uh, season. They are uh, uh, on their way back to the Championship but they still would like to make uh, to go in, in the best possible way. The Red Devils are coming, however, on the back of two consecutive defeats and uh, although they have secured already the top four, we do expect that they will want to uh, give the fans some, something to cheer in a, and also to get them uh, prepared in the best possible way ahead of the Europa League final against Villarreal. The, their last two performances have been uh, disappointing from Manchester United, especially the 4-2 defeat to Liverpool exposed that uh, Without uh, Harry Maguire at the back, uh, Manchester United have a defence that is very close to a shamble. In fact, um, they, uh, they seem to have lost complete solidity and uh, we expect something similar against Fulham, although obviously Fulham has not the same qualities as Liverpool, so we do not expect them to score four goals, but there will be probably goals and uh, Scott Parker will try to um, also motivate his play to end a disappointing season in the best possible way. Uh, they were, however, defeated again on, against Southampton on Saturday and at the moment they're coming to Old Trafford after being, picking up just one point in the last eight games and uh, in total now they've uh, conceded 19 defeats this season. So obviously a full side that is very weak. So with both uh, Cottagers and Manchester United that have problems at the back, we do expect goals to be uh, more than two, uh, at least three. Uh, in fact, both sides have conceded seven goals in the last three games. So the under 2.5 looks the best uh, odds, uh, the best option here. And we coupled that with Manchester United to win. As I said before, Manchester United will want to uh, finish uh, the Premier League in the best possible way. They have the quality to defeat Fulham. They are coming from two defeats and they need to prove something to their uh, fans. They will want to welcome their fans back into the stadium with a win. So. Manchester United to win and uh, over 2.5 is our first selection. The second selection is coming from Italy and is Lazio against Torino. In this case, we are backing Lazio to win. Lazio have, uh, um, are coming into this match uh, on the back of the defeat in the uh, Derby della Capitale in Rome uh, against Rome uh, in the last weekend. However, before that, they managed to win 12 games in a row at the Stadio Olimpico. So they are definitely a team that can do well at home. And uh, um, also, 
Simone Inzaghi will uh, will try to uh, bounce back immediately, and it takes on a, a Torino side that uh, have lost their last two matches and conceded 11 goals in the process. After finishing fourth in the last season, uh, it has been quite a disappointing journey for Lazio this, in this term. However, they have secured Europa League uh, and uh, they will want to uh, finish in the best possible way. Torino are coming into this match in uh, trouble because they are fighting to avoid relegation. Obviously, they will be more motivated, but if, you look, if we look at the results that they have achieved in recent time, they won just one of the last six matches and also have lost the last three. Uh, and the last two uh, encounters were very disappointing against Milan and Spezia. So we do expect uh, to see um, a match that uh, Milan uh, will actually, the Lazio will actually um, dominate. And uh, in this case, there is also an additional uh, thing to consider as Lazio have, uh, um, have been, uh, are managed by Simone Inzaghi. And Simone Inzaghi is the brother of uh, Filippo Inzaghi who is uh, uh, currently uh, the manager of uh, Benevento. And Benevento are fighting against Torino head to head in terms of to, to try to avoid relegation. So we do expect that uh, uh, Simone Inzaghi, which is managing Lazio, will want to, make, uh, to, want to give his brother a favour and will motivate, uh, extra motivate his players to do a good match uh, against uh, um, Torino. So we are backing uh, Torino uh, to lose in this match. So Lazio uh, should have the quality to defeat uh, a Torino side that have been in very disappointing form recently. And that is the second selection of our bet. And we are backing uh, this double with a medium confidence as we believe that there are good opportunities to come out, but obviously some risk as we are heading towards the end of the season. Now, uh, stay with us as we are uh, heading immediately from, to our Premier League expert, Robbie Billund, that will give us the tips on the uh, Premier League for Tuesday. I can see that Robin is connected with us. So, Robin, that's over to you. Hi, everyone. We are back again. And we are now in the final week of this Premier League season. We have game week 37 which will be played here on Tuesday and Wednesday. And then we have game week 38 on Sunday. And it's still a lot to decide in the Premier League, especially, of course, uh, around the Champions League places, also the Europa League places. So there is still much to play for. And we have some very, very uh, exciting and interesting games coming up here. And we have, of course, start by looking on Tuesday night, where some of those teams that are involved in the action here in terms of deciding the places, uh, especially Champions League, will be out playing. And um, we have the replay of the FA Cup final from Saturday, Chelsea against Leicester which is coming up on Tuesday night. And after Liverpool's dramatic win with Alisson scoring the game-winning goal in the 95th minute, um, there is um, a lot to play for at Stamford Bridge. Of course, it should be mentioned that this game week will also see fans returning to the stands. So to take that into account, especially looking at the home teams that might feel that they get the boost they've been longing for for over a year um, will of course uh, have some impact as well. We have uh, picked out a Tuesday double for you and also a uh, best bet of the day of course for Tuesday. Um, we start at uh, Amex Stadium in Brighton where uh, the home team uh, have Manchester City uh, joining them. Of course, uh, Man City already the winners of Premier League and uh, they uh, don't have anything to play for. Everything is about preparations ahead of the Champions League final that's coming up next weekend. Um, and uh, we saw that against Newcastle on Friday where they Rotate a lot, even giving Scott Carson uh, a chance to be in the goal uh, 10 years from his last Premier League uh, appearance. So um, Manchester City, they of course, they rotate. They are finding players in form ahead of the final. Pep wants to see everyone in action here. Uh, what do doesn't want to take any risks, of course. And I think that boosted by 
fans on the stadium, uh, Brighton that has nothing to play for anymore. Uh, we know that they have had expected goals to be very high in the table, but it took to the final rounds here is to decide that they even would stay up in the Premier League. But now everything is done and dusted. They will be a Premier League team for next season. And I think on Tuesday night at Amex Stadium, we will see a very good game of football. And I think it will be quite open as well. So we are backing over 2.5 goals in this game. In our Tuesday double, we are combining that with under 2.5 goals in uh, Chelsea against Leicester. Uh, we saw on Saturday that it was too well organized, very defensive, very structured teams that played in the FA Cup final. Leicester coming out on top, winning 1-0. Of course, a big triumph for the Foxes. And Chelsea are now actually in a situation... Uh, where a loss here against uh, Leicester and then a loss against Manchester City in the Champions League final could see them without anything at the end of this season. Um, looking back just a few weeks, it looked like Thomas Tuchel would take Chelsea to huge highs. Uh, of course, there are still all the chances for that, but also more at stake now. Chelsea have to step up. Now they have the home advantage. They have fans back at Stamford Bridge. It will be very interesting to see how they react to the loss on Saturday. But especially, I do think that both teams will be very careful here. Um, it's none of those teams that want to lose this game. And I think both teams will be quite careful. So under 2.5 goals is what we are expecting here. So the Tuesday double is over 2.5 in Brighton against City. And then under 2.5 in Chelsea against Leicester. Our best bet for Tuesday is from Manchester United against Fulham, where the home side is letting fans, now also with tickets, not only protesting, into Old Trafford uh, for the home game here against Fulham. Uh, Man United have lost double back-to-back uh, -back fixtures here against Leicester and Liverpool. Now they have a few days extra to rest and will be back here wanting to end the season on a high, especially with fans back in the stands. Uh, Mason Greenwood has shown great potential, great quality over the last few weeks. I think he will get the nod from Ole Gunnar to start this game. And I think Man United will go out here and score a lot of goals. So we are backing Man United to win on a minus one handicap, uh, winning by at least two goals then. And that is our best bet of the day for Tuesday. Both those bets are backed with a medium stake. Uh, we are uh, very comfortable with those. And I think this will be a good start for game week 37. And then we will be back looking at Wednesday as well. But uh, back, hopefully, those bets. We hope to win together. And I'll speak to you soon again. Thank you very much, Robin. And let's hope that we can get more winning bets coming from you. There are uh, a lot of uh, opportunities to bet this week. So starting with a nice win would be very much appreciated. So far, uh, we are having a very good success with our bets here, Babies for You TV. Uh, as you can see uh, in the screen, we are actually uh, delivering a very nice profit in uh, May so far. So let's hope that we can finish off the month with a very positive result. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. All you need to do is to click on the subscribe button after you have logged in into your YouTube account and also hit the bell as that will allow you to get notification every time we post a new video. If we manage to get you to win some bets or if you like our show, please put a big thumbs up as that will allow us to grow the channel even more and produce more and more free content for you with quality tips. Also, if you like some of the bets that we suggest in this show, simply check on the description below as you will find all the links of the bets. And uh, you simply click on those links and the bets will load up in the bookmaker that we have selected for you as uh, those are the bookmaker that have the best uh, odds at the time of recording. Obviously, odds are subject to change, so uh, double check them before betting. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, we come back next week, uh, in the next few days, uh, with more shows so make sure you are uh, uh, subscribed and uh, get notifications so you don't miss anything but if you decide to play some of the bets tonight I wish you great luck uh, and uh, always remember to gamble responsibly. Bye now, I'll see you tomorrow.